So we are checking out of our hotel and we go <laughs> <laughs> we go to leave and we're stuck inside. Oh nice. Did it. Oh good job. Alright, well don't let it close all the way. Okay. Uh, I'll just throw the deadbolt. Here. Let go. There we go. That works. There was a I heard something fall when I came in. Uh, like a screw. Probably the screw to hold this thing in place, but Aha! Uh -huh. I figured it out. <laughs> that we were gonna have to call the front desk and be like, can you open our door for us? <laughs> Never a dull moment with us. Today the plan is to make it to Montana. Oh, that's the plan? Yeah. Huh. I, I'm giving us short achievable goals, attainable goals. Is Montana achievable and short attainable today? I think so. It's about 300 miles away. Okay. I think we can do that easily in a day. Let's do it. that had some artwork. So now we are seeing tons and tons and tons of signs for things like 1880s town and... Wall drug. Wall drug. That's been going on for what? Like Over almost, 100 miles. Yeah, almost 100 miles uh, for advertisements for wall drug, which we haven't seen yet. So I just got the green light from Katie that I can stop in 1880s town which was fe featured in the Smithsonian and the Guide to Historic America, for those of you that didn't know. Also, American, or the Pickers. Oh, American Pickers TV show went there. Yep. And it was also written up in the New York Times. Yeah. We've learned this through the signs that we've been seeing for the last 30-some miles. Anyway, so we're going to go and see if the 1880s town is less or more hyped than the Corn Palace, or okay. if it's living up to its yeah. hype. I'm excited. I see that. I can see the excitement bouncing off of you. Is it because you're zoomed in? I'm yeah. not anymore. As you zoom in, you can see the excitement. Tell me when you're zoomed in. All right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, that was fun. Yeah. I have a good feeling about this one. Do you? I do. Oh, look, there's dinosaurs. Nah, that's cool. I don't think it's open. Don't, don't, don't you be doing that. <laughs> it is open. It's open? It doesn't 
Yes. Let's look open. Yes, it's open. I mean, it's been open since the 1880s. What are the chances that it's closed when we try to get there? It's very high. Oh, it's open. It's open. Look at all the people. So, Nate, how excited are you? Uh, what's the scale? One to ten. Okay, that's a lame scale. One to a hundred. Oh, um, four. Forty? Nine. Forty-nine. Point. Point. Three. Okay. I took my spot. Five. Well, you were taking too long. Well, I know. I was undecided. Yes, you were. Can you get that? 49.35 out of 100. Plus. Oh, plus. A million. You're so excited. <laughs> All right. I wonder if dogs are allowed. I don't know. Let's go find out. There's right. a pet rest area. <gasps> oh, good. Is it? It's not fenced in. It's just a... Uh... Let's go. I wonder if it's better than the Missouri rest area. <laughs> This, well, yeah, it is because there's three fire hydrants. <gasps> there's three. And a dog and a frog that they can pee on. There is the Let's go 1880 rest area. They knew how to party in the 80s. They, 1880s. 1880s. Gonna party like it's 1880 town. Nice, that was good. Diner closed. This was actually a diner? Mm-hmm. Okay. I think this is a train diner. So they, like, can you just settle? They allow dogs, but it's a $12 per person admission. Okay. And it's one of those things where there's a gift shop at the end kind of thing. Uh huh. And it's just so, I mean, let's go spend our money and time elsewhere. Okay. We decided to go continue westbound and go check out the Badlands. Right? Yes. Yeah. See what that's like with a nice smoke covered haze <laughs> that's coming in from the west. See if the doggies are also in the badlands. We're doing the badlands. We're doing the badlands. Badlands. Oh, the prairie homestead. We have to stop there. We have to? Don't we? It's a 1909 historical sod house. Yes! Yes, we're doing that. We are doing that. Katie gave me carte blanche to stop wherever I wanted. <laughs> She's gonna say, oh man, why did I do that? Oh, this is gonna be so good. National Register of Historic Places, one and one half mile. <laughs> I'm so excited, we're doing a sod house. Oh, we can make our own sod house if we ever buy a homestead. <laughs> if we ever find land. <laughs> Historic farm life. Yes, let's do it. That's so exciting. I can see the Badlands. I know. In the distance. That's so cool. So a little fun fact about me, I grew up in Omaha, Nebraska, and one of my dad's favorite things to do was to come to the Badlands, Mount Rushmore, Mount or Custer State Park, Yellowstone State Park. So I grew up, this was kind of my family vacation. Did you ever do the Prairie Homestead? I'm sure we did at one point in time, but I do not remember it. We're at the Sawhouse. 
Oh, this is so good. This is so good. Can we turn? Oh, here we go. 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 Oh, there's come see prairie do prairie dogs too. Oh, yes. gotta slow down. Oh. Coming in hot. Coming in hot. Celebrating the 150th anniversary of the Homestead Act, 1862 to 2012. Are you okay, honey? What? Are you a little sad? Uh, I mean, it's closed. That's too bad. But we can still see it. We'll zoom. We'll use the, the optical zoom feature on our devices. Okay. Let's go. All right. All right. So we are at the Prairie Homestead. No pets. Uh, no pets allowed, and they're closed. So we can only observe. There's prairie dogs. Prairie dogs. There's prairie dogs. So we can only observe from the fence line. There's about 15 I can see. There's oh. prairie dogs. There's so many of them. I can't zoom up far enough for the camera to see them. Oh, I see them. This one right here, he's the one making all the noise. Oh, yeah. Let's see, can we... The prairie dog is right there. And the one right there is also making noise. Oh, yeah. Looking. And then this one right here is making a noise. I wish I could zoom in more, but I can't. <coughs> all right, so look at these awesome buildings. Look how they go into the earth. Yeah, how it, really cool. how it, so you have the root cellar that goes into the, into the earth up, up there. Yep. Really cool. oh, I should get the drone out. That'd be cool. That I wonder if cool. I could. Probably not. Huh. Well, this is cool, but I can't really capture it very well for you. Well, shoot, guys. I was excited to show you a, an original homestead homestead, but they're closed, so. It's okay. It it's looks right. really cool. It does look cool. Yeah. Looks like some of the properties we've looked at. <laughs> it really does. <laughs> I'd buy this. You'd buy this? Yeah. Just needs some paint. If it has a creek. I don't think it has a creek. Oh, uh, that's right. There's no creek. All right. Here we are, guys. We are in the Badlands. Oh, it's so exciting. It's so pretty. Oh, it sucks. Oh, my goodness. I didn't even <laughs> look to my left. Whoa. Or to your right. Whoa. Whoa. It's so smoky. It is very smoky. Wow. Oh, that is so cool. Okay, so we are at one of the rest stops, or one of the... The scenic areas. Thank you. We're at one yeah. of the scenic areas <laughs> at the Badlands, and we were going to take some trails, but they don't allow dogs, so we're just going to kind of walk the parking lot and get some, get some up-close footage. Yeah. While we walk the dogs. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, with, with the dogs, yeah. Katie kept the dogs on in the parking lot. I'm going to walk here and just see what kind of views we can get. Okay. Yeah, that was a really cool view. Yeah. Yeah, very cool. Lots of people lost lost their hats. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, yep. all right, let's go into the car and just drive and get seen anything there. Perfect. Yep, since we can't take the dogs yeah. on the trails. Sorry, guys. There's a lot of dogs out here, too. Yeah. A bunch. We got time on our side. We're in a state of hope. I need you on my fire. I want you to know. Every time you're away, I long for you so much I can find my way. We got everything here, at least to stay alive, and the 
time that we share Makes it all worthwhile Got this place on Do you feel like we got something strong? And I saw you City of Wall, South Dakota, home of Wall Drug. We've seen signs for Wall Drug for the last few hundred miles, at least a hundred miles, if not more. So of course you have to stop after you see it that many times. So we're making our way. We just exited the Badlands. Here we are. But we're gonna see what it has to offer. It's a whole giant little city. It's a whole giant little city. It's a whole They have soda fountains and ice cream, honey. Ice cream. You want ice cream? They have ice cream. I do want ice, you cream. Want ice cream. Let's get some ice cream. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. Yes, ice cream. <laughs> Let's get some ice cream. Yes. Yes. Do you have your wallet on you? Yes. Look at that. Ice cream. You scream. We scream. I'm going to eat your ice cream. That's not how it goes. No just got out of the uh, restaurant cat or from the cafe it's a very long line <laughs> so I decided that it's not worth it so we're gonna head back on to the road and get into Montana tonight clearly he wasn't that excited for ice cream well I was but then I saw the line and I'm like no uh-uh nah -uh. -uh. no not doing that all right so all right hit the road there's my only Welcome to Wyoming. Thank you. That was kind of you. How do they know that this is Wyoming? It's like there's nothing dividing. There's no like, yellow line. There's no chalk line. There isn't a river. The grass isn't greener. Like, how do they know? You know? How do they know it's actually different state. And it looks the same. Driving on the same side of the road. 
anticlimactic for you, wasn't it? Well, we were welcomed. So, I mean, there's that. Uh, yeah, other than that, it was pretty... I mean, so far, South Dakota has treated me better than Wyoming. So, there's that. <laughs> Spent a lot more time in South Dakota than we did in Wyoming. Or that we're going to. We're only going through the northeast tip of Wyoming. Before we know it, it will be saying, Welcome to Montana. Before we know it, in fact, right now. Welcome to Montana. Thank you.